Meteorologist Joe Hansel here with a look at your Thursday forecast. We essentially have three frontal systems, maybe three and a half, that are bringing in substantial weather across the nation. One area low pressure will bring in widespread rain, heavy amounts to the south in the Gulf of Mexico states. Areas of severe weather are a possibility today, tonight, and tomorrow as well there. Front in the northeast, lingering snow there stretches to the Great Lakes. A system could bring in some snow along areas like Denver, Colorado Springs, near the Colorado Rocky foothills. And the strongest of them all in the Pacific, actually making its way on shore, which could bring close to three feet of snow in one mountain range for the next couple of days. I'll specify where in just a minute. To the southeast, that dark green shade, that is a marginal risk of severe weather. It includes Dallas, Texarkana, near the Louisiana, Arkansas, Mississippi state lines. Damaging winds, large hail possible late this afternoon through tonight out there. In terms of winter concerns, winter storm warnings in the pink shades, one in Maine. One generally in the Grand Teton Mountains, one in the Rockies, one up and down the Cascades. That blue shade is an avalanche warning today for the Rockies of western Montana. And some wind advisories in the tan, high wind warnings in the yellow. Santa Ana's still impacting areas near Los Angeles today. Looking at some high temperatures, St. Louis, 47, smack dab in the middle of the nation. Temperatures smack dab in the middle today essentially as well. 39 in Chicago, 73 in Houston. Texas with that chance of rain. Still plenty of snow. Watching for a couple or a few inches along the Colorado foothills. Could see over a half a foot in some of the high elevations out there today. Salt Lake City, a few inches of snow in the forecast. Could see over a foot in the Rockies and close to three feet, up to 30 inches of snow up and down the Cascades. So be prepared of winter-like driving conditions around the mountainous areas as our very next front pushes in from the northwest today and from Dallas and areas of the southeast United States. Heavy rain could see one to three inches today and tomorrow.